Welcome. Hi, everybody. We, I am J.D. Burns, and we are playing a game called Polybridge. This is new indie game on Steam. It's pretty cool. You build uh, bridges. And I'm going to start by just building a simple bridge with this for this van. And don't worry, we're going to build way... What's that radius? Is that how far you can build? Yeah. And so right now I'm putting a road down, and... When I start the simulation. Oh, that's cool. So it goes yeah. like to a design mode to a 3D mode, and your camper just went into the water. Yeah, and the bridge collapsed in on itself. So, so I, you're building a bridge to get that little minivan across this river. Yeah. So I need to add support for the bridge. And uh, you may be disappointed thinking, why aren't you going to build a weird bridge where everything still works? And don't worry, I will be doing that later, but this is just for demonstration purposes. Because I like to play this game by building really weird bridges but they're usually over budget and you can still pass the level if the bridge is over budget but if it's above budget you can still continue but you have to get a certain number of levels below budget because there's different regions kind of like in besiege yeah uh and but if a certain number of levels are over budget then you can't continue with the next region i'm just finishing up this bridge here it's probably way too many supports nope it's just enough supports and now the Dudes just got across the bridge. They're gonna go catch some lolly waves, man. So, I this is a ramp, and you have to build a ramp. So, this guy on the scooter in the left of the screen can get across. And did you get the? I must have missed it. Did you get the van across? Oh yeah. Hey, congratulations. Thank you. I'm really proud of you. I'm now a qualified bridge designer. You can build a bridge anywhere in the world. Yep. Thanks to Poly Bridge. Thanks, Poly Bridge. You really did some stuff. So this was a game I gifted you on Steam. Oh, that's cool. Can we see what that looks like? Can you like just test yep. that bridge? That's obviously not gonna work. Say hey, scooter. Oh, uh, never mind. Yep. The, for some reason, even if the bridge collapse, the cars still drive across anyway. Oh, yeah. So if you notice in the top of the screen, it says I can only b use ten wood resources before I run out. And then what do you do? Uh, and then I can't use any more wood, so I have to like use it accordingly. So I'm gonna delete all this. You're not gonna have enough to make it across though. Well, you can only build two roads. So we gotta make a jump. Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, oh, he made it. Yep. All right. He got his flag. So, now that that's done, I'm gonna show you a, like you can build a, well, you have to build a You have a unlimited bridge. road on this one. Yep. And that's it, nothing else. So it's just a road. Well, no, uh, you have to like go to each resource to see what you have. Yeah. Oh, wood's unlimited too. So oh, you have unlimited road and you have unlimited wood? Yeah. Some missions or levels, I don't know what it would be called. I guess contracts in this game would, uh, you have like certain resources. Like I can't use any of this stuff. Yeah. So I have to build a bridge over the boat. Or you could do what I, what I promised to do and then you could build a weird bridge. For example, building a bridge under the boat. Under the boat? Yeah. Is that going to work? It might. Here it comes. I can see it. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. It's way under there. But the question is, will the car... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the answer is... Nope. Probably not. So, certain vehicles weigh more. For example, like a school bus would weigh more than an SUV. Yeah. There's like scooters that weigh less and stuff. So, if someone was wanting to study mechanical engineering... You know, Trevor has a degree in engineering. Did you know that? No. Nope. He, Trevor is the editor for these videos. For, yeah, for among other things, yes. Yeah. But he's not mechanical engineering. I believe, if I recall correctly, he is an aerospace engineer. What does an aerospace engineer do? do you Don't think? they design aerodynamics? Mm-hmm. And like planes and stuff. And space shuttles and stuff. That's cool. But you know, you know who was a mechanic? Who's a character in a book that you recently read that was a mechanical engineer? Uh, the. The character, the main, the only character in The Martian. Well, one of the main characters in The Martian. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I haven't gotten to that point yet. Yeah, it's Watney. Well, yeah, I mean, there are other characters, but they're not, it, like, they're just mentioned. I haven't actually finished the book yet. I know. You're going to watch the movie? You're going to finish it before the movie comes out? Yeah, hopefully. Dude, you're going to love it. That book's a great book. Oh, yeah. I'd also like to point out, I don't know that there's a hundred cents and a dollar. Speaking <laughs> of money. They might not have heard that video yet. JD had a kind of a slip and yeah. forgot that there was... What, 100 cents and a dollar? Yeah, I said there was 60 cents. <laughs> and you'll never you get to see it. You know, it is a it. cent. You know, that means in Latin, that means 100. So, it's 
That's where it comes from. Like a centimeter. It's a hundredth of a meter. Yeah, well. So a cent of a dollar. This is America. We don't use the metric system. Well, we still call it cents. How dare you? Yeah. How dare you? Oh, oh. Did you make it? it? No. I, I think I might have to redesign this bridge. If you lived in this town, would you drive across this bridge? A bridge that went underwater? Yeah, I mean, if the, the problem is the car would stall. Yes. And we would drown. Here we go. Oh, please make it. Where's it falling apart? It's oh, falling he's there. Up. Yeah. Are you just trying to go under the ship for the heck of it? Or is this yeah. the actual solution? No, the actual solution is probably build over the ship. But I said at the beginning of the video that I would build the weirdest bridge as possible. So. Uh, mission accomplished. Yeah. This one actually looks pretty good. You think it's going to clear? Oh, it's not going to clear. Oh, oh, it did. Boat went through. All right, now watch the... Tr let's watch the, sh the station wagon. Yay! Oh, my gosh. Yay! I, I almost hate that the game rewarded you for that. That yeah. underwater bridge. Yeah. <laughs> I would not be a very good bridge designer. Okay. In the so, real world, you know what it's called when you build an underwater bridge? Uh, impo impossibility. It's called you're fired. <laughs> yeah. who, who are you? Get out of my yeah. office. All right. So on this one, I have hydraulics, so I can actually use it to like lift the road up. And oh, I like a drawbridge. Yeah, I probably will do that for demonstration purposes. Gosh, I can't just do what I want to do. Wish I could just bend physics to my will. So what's that split joint? What does that do? All right. So if I don't use a split joint, it'll just like uh, pull the like road apart. It'll tear the bridge apart. But when I use a split joint, it tears the road apart, but in the safe way. Right. It's by design. Yeah. This is looking good. This actually looks like a really solid bridge. Unfortunately. Not that your other bridges didn't look incredibly solid. Yeah. Look at this. They're all symmetrical. I would drive on this bridge. Oh, it's hideous. If I saw that underwater, up. Oh, if I saw that underwater bridge, I'd be like, "We're gonna go around." Yeah. So this game actually does teach you a little bit about like reinforcement and structure and everything else, huh? Yeah. I still don't want you building any bridges that I drive across. No offense. Oh yeah, I'm so offended. It's. A, I think it's better than uh, besieged. What are you doing here? What's all the arrows and business going on? Uh, that was hydraulics, but I put it down the wrong spot. So. Gotcha. Okay. So you need something to pull up with, I guess. Yep. Look at this solid looking bridge. Will that raise it on its own? Yeah. Unfortunately, you can't just lift it when the car comes across. I see. Hey, Joe the Cat. Joe the Cat's coming up knocking stuff over. Come here, buddy. Come here, Joe the Cat. You want to come in here? Wait, I don't want to go anymore. Oh, your other car made it across. Yay. Even the big monster Joe the Cat that just walked across in front of us. Couldn't, yep. couldn't keep that from working properly. Okay, so uh, I could just do another drawbridge, but wh why would I do that? Oh, wait, that's going to be way too steep. <laughs> I like it, though. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to do another underwater bridge. No. Nope. Okay, so the, there is a road budget, so I will have to do this normally. Man, this game limits your creativity. Man, having a budget, though. you got to be creative with your budget. Welcome, you welcome to the wonderful world of being a mechanical engineer. This might actually be more civil engineering than mechanical engineering. So I have a budget on steel, too. I don't think I have a budget on wood. Yeah, I have unlimited. So go crazy with the wood, right? Yeah. And you can build a robust bridge. So I find that this like cross section works a lot more than the other thing. What do you mean? This view? No, I mean like when you build like this box with the cross thing mm -hmm. in the middle. With the reinforcement there? Yeah. What works better than what? Uh, like other techniques, like you can go like this. I think I'm doing this wrong. You need a drawbridge. Yeah. Just showing it. You hit Z to undo? Yeah. Or you can hold Alt and delete stuff. It's a fun game. Do you like it? Yeah. It's pretty fun for a bridge building game like this. It's like, un it's like surprisingly fun. Yeah, you didn't play, uh, you didn't play Besieged for very long, or Besiege. And that was a building game, too. Yeah. That looks like a weird setup. Yeah. That looks like it's going to pull two things at once. <laughs> good, <laughs> good test. Yep. <laughs> do it again. I want to see that again. All right. I'll it. slow it down. Yeah. It's not pulling itself apart. It's just falling. <laughs> there goes the little family. It's the, it's the hydraulics. That... Is it? The hydraulics are pulling it? Yeah. Undo itself? Oh. Well, yeah. Need other hydraulics then. Okay. This should work. 
Nope. <laughs> Famous last words. So I think you're just collapsing straight through the center. You don't have any support on the... Yeah. I need a better, uh, like, hydraulic system, I think, too. So I could do something like... You can make that lower, couldn't you, that first one? The, like, the steel thing? Yeah. Make the pole a little bit lower. But the problem is it, like, I guess it... Oh, yeah, it would reach. I think so. Right. Or the shot, anyway. Has to be a high tall. Well, no, it doesn't. I just get the. I say it has to be taller than the ship, but it really doesn't. Yeah, it still doesn't reach. So. He's got. Where does it have to reach to? All the way to the green. Yeah, that's how it, it'll work best like that. It can still work with two hydraulic systems connected, but as you saw earlier, it like ripped everything to shreds. So that we don't want that. To, we don't want that to happen. Okay. Wait, just test these hydraulics. Oh wait. Oh, okay. It seems like that cable that's reinforcing that pole up there doesn't really connect to the bridge in either way. What do you mean? Oh, never mind. I just think it was weak enough. It was weak towards the right of the bridge. That's a problem. Oh, I know what. Oh. I know what the problem is. Ship looked like he was about to take out your bridge too. Yep. You gotta do one problem at a time. That's exactly what he says in the Martian. Oh. All right. So this one looks pretty good. And it gets a little wonky right there, but he makes it anyway. Yeah. Okay. Is this gonna work? The hydraulics going down is interesting. Oh, no, that's not gonna work. Yeah, that was rough. It's a big boat. So now it's going through. Here comes the scooter dude. You can do it, scooter dude. Jump! Oh, you didn't even try. Yeah. So, you gotta go up with those. Yeah. So I'm gonna, instead of having, like, it's gonna be like, oh wait, no, the boat will still hit it anyway. Never mind. Take that middle point on that one box and move it to the left. Okay. And then see if you can connect to that. Yep. Gotta build a road. Yeah. I like the music in this game, but it's like yeah. kind of sad. Maybe it's honoring the lives of the people who fell off the bridge. All the workers. Yeah. Spent time away from their families building a bridge that goes underwater. <laughs> How many lives would be lost building a bridge that goes underwater? Oh, got to add split joint. I'll just show you what happens if you don't have a split joint. Oh, no. Here come the hydraulics. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that's what'll happen. Yep. The force has to go somewhere, right? <laughs> wow. Well, the ship was safe. Yep. Alright, so split joints there. Here we go. I don't think anything... It'd be kind of neat if you could sink ships, but, Yeah. uh, this isn't exactly a war game. That'd be interesting if there's a game where you had these bridges to destroy stuff. Bridges are... Oh, I think it's gonna make it. It's, that one's still just not going down far enough. Oh, come on. Bridges are a big deal. That should be a t-shirt. Well, we we're, we live in Austin, Texas, right? Yeah. And oh, we, really? we recently moved because we lived in a part of town where we had to cross the river every time we went to work. And there was only four places in the whole city to cross the river. I think you're gonna make it here, bud. Yeah, I don't know if the this uh, if the left side's gonna come back up again though. No, really. Yeah. The left side's a little troublemaker for us. Yeah. It's gonna make it. Yep. It's not pretty. Oh, look, it joined up and everything. Yeah. Scooters. Go hillbilly. Yeah, if the car made it, the scooter's gonna make it. Hit the gas, buddy. High five. Put it up top. There you go. Good okay. job, man. Okay. Oh, a two-parter, huh? Yeah. I completed this one before and it was kind of difficult. I'm just gonna. Oh. I, so, was I was able to make a bridge on this one where it would work by like it didn't collapse because it. Oh wait, never mind. This one. You have unlimited road. Yeah, I thought I didn't. That's pretty serious. Yeah. Why are you going down like that? Because uh, I won't need to add supports. I don't know how they're gonna make it up. So. It's a pretty steep incline. Well, there. I guess you need some supports. Yeah. And it looks like both uh, vehicles go at once, too. Yeah. This should be good enough. I just want to see if they make it through the first part. They probably will, though. Looks pretty solid. Bye-bye. <laughs> what if that was the way they actually tested bridges? They were like, hey, we got half of it done. Wait, yeah. come take a ride. Then again, I think normally people would be smart enough not to keep driving. Enjoy your swim, chumps. 
might go over budget here. And now I've seen gifts for this game and little short videos. It reminds me a lot of Besiege where people like try to do the most random stuff. Why did that break? I don't Too know. Too heavy? Yeah, it must have been. So good though. I think you, this you, is good enough right here. There was actually a bridge up north in the U.S. that just suddenly collapsed one day. The like Mothman was people, involved. People were to Mothman. People were just driving over it like they do every day, and then whoop, collapsed. Didn't make that noise. Yeah. Probably went like and that <laughs> never ever happens. I wouldn't want anybody to worry that like the bridges in their town are ready to collapse. That thing is gonna hold. You I don't it. think most people have that fear. Well, you know, a lot of kids watch these videos. I wouldn't want them to think that like. Oh yeah. Some bad cap. Speaking of what your Who school bus. Love Good old yellow school bus. Be careful though, it's packed full of screaming children high on sugar. Uh oh. Will you be able to get them safely across? But the real question is do you want to? Do you want to? And the answer is of course you do.